Hi, this is Leanne, and today I want to talk to you about how to choose the right Benjamin Moore product for your project. So today I picked uh, a few different lines to talk about. Uh, the first one is the Ben line. The Ben line is an entry level line, and it's designed for your homeowner in mind. It's a vinyl coating. It uh, has a longer open time, which means it doesn't dry as quick. So it's more designed for your homeowner who needs to go back, maybe hit spots that they missed, or if they have a little sag to go back and touch that up. Um, it's, it's still a great paint by Benjamin Moore. Uh, its price point is a little less than the other lines and um, maybe more of a affordable solution for your homeowner. So the next line up in the spectrum is the Regal Select line. This is 100% acrylic coating um, as opposed to the Ben. It has superior mildew resistance, less spatter, it's a little bit of a thicker coating than the Ben line. They still recommend two coats for every project, um, but it, it is a little thicker coating than the Ben. It's made with the Gen X colorant as well. All of, three, all of these three products are made with Gen X. It's a midpoint price range, and it's more of a premium line of paint. The thickest coating that we have would be the Aura line of paint which um, Aura is like king of the crop in the land of Benjamin Moore. It has the Gen X color lock technology. It's got a more solid molecule in the resin, which holds the color, holds onto the color better throughout the can of paint, as opposed to uh, the other lines. It uh, is a th the thickest coating that Benjamin Moore makes, as well as it has scuff resistance in the final coating. If you're looking for exterior products, Benjamin Moore does offer a wide range of stains and exterior paints. We have the Arbor Coat line in latex in a solid, semi-solid, and semi-transparent and transparent lines. And being that we are in Vermont, we still do offer oil-based stains as well. Unfortunately, uh, Benjamin Moore doesn't make a solid body oil anymore, but we do have a semi-solid availability as well as a semi-transparent and a transparent. Your, your old timer uh, paint people swear by oil, but I will say that nowadays with the improved uh, color, color retention in the tints that the latex is really a comparable product. Um, the oil-based stains will penetrate further into the wood. Your acrylic stains will uh, coat the surface of the wood better. So if you have a real moisture issue, you would probably prefer an acrylic stain over an oil. Um, if you have a real dry substrate, you would probably prefer an oil.